welcome to the channel, ladies and gentlemen. This is really quite shocking, I guess, but also not, and is also definitely, massively, a cautionary tale, uh, unfortunately. Now, we'll talk about the title first, which is Arch, Arch Warhammer. Um, but then I also want to touch on some other bits and pieces, because I've received some messages saying, look, definitely be careful. YouTube is on a purge, and they are. And there's some other big people that they've deleted. Now, this one isn't a deleting, right? But this isn't necessarily to say that they won't just delete it retroactively. So, what's happened here is Arch Warhammer had his channel hacked. And I don't understand how. It happened a few days ago. Um, quite a while ago, actually, now. And I didn't talk about it because I saw... I saw that he'd already reached out to YouTube and I was like, oh, that's fine then. They'll sort it, right? Um, but nothing's happened yet. And I don't know whether this is part of that weird purge that happened. So, yeah. Let's talk about it. Let's make some noise. Um, now, this is to say that, you know, whatever you think of Arch Warhammer's personal uh, opinions and beliefs, I don't actually know him, to be perfectly honest. Some people say he's... A whole bunch of ists and phobes. I just know he's made alright Warhammer content. That's all I know. Um, so I'm not here to say go Arch Warhammer uh, for all of his personal beliefs. I'm just here to say no one should have their channel hacked and then deleted. That's garbage. Uh, no matter what you think of them really. I'd say the same if it was a lefty versus a righty whatever. It, it really, uh, you know, it's across the board personally. And then like I said I do want to touch on this this big purge that seems to be happening and then also address whether I'm on the chopping block because I've reached out to YouTube personally today um, which is interesting so basically um, he got hacked right this channel has been hacked from team YouTube uh, and then uh, this was all on the 6th of January and he tweeted out saying, I just want to say thank you all so much for your love, support and help. I did receive a message from Dean YouTube and sent them the information. I haven't heard anything back yet, uh, but hopeful this will all start getting sorted out soon. Thank you all again. But nothing's happened. Nothing's happened at all. But then he is on Rumble as well. I don't really know whether that... I don't, is that like a, is that a video website? I don't know. But then obviously lots of support and things like that. Apparently, what I can ascertain happened was someone hacked him. I still don't understand how people get hacked, but okay. Someone hacked him. And then someone started running Bitcoin, which seemed... I think that's pretty similar to what happened to... Um, the Astartes, but I think they might have also been running porn, I can't remember. But anyway, that's normally what happens. They run all this kind of crap, and they get shut down by YouTube because YouTube uh, bots and people don't discern the difference, which I think is a real shame. It's fundamentally, it, it's a flaw in YouTube's system, right? It's a massive flaw. Uh, they really should discern the difference, right? When, when a channel goes so breakneck you get whiplash from one style of content to another that should pretty much flag up to team youtube something's going on so i think that's a fundamental flaw with youtube quite frankly and it's something that they really do need to resolve but then we go on to the other things that have happened um and it's pretty big uh, there's people being deleted left right and center now perhaps the biggest one the uh, came on to sort of my radar um, was someone who I like I've never had any personal dealings with them before and um, they've quoted me in one of their videos um, and I used to watch their videos and I thought it was really decent I really like their channel um, but it was Dave Cullen computing forever I don't really know why why did he get deleted? So, first and foremost, let's make some noise about Arch. You know, I don't think anyone should get the channel deleted. But, again, I do think YouTube, if they want to delete him now, they just will. They will just leave it, which sucks a lot. 
Um, but then here you go. So this is uh, th this is the statement by Dave Cullen. Um, and it said, after 14 years, 500,000 subscribers and over 100 million views, my channel, Computing Forever, has been deleted off YouTube. I knew it was coming. It's okay. Uh, I always knew this time would come. I'm delighted to be part of a free speech alt tech revolution. I've developed platforms on Minds, Gab, Odyssey, and BitChute, and I'm excited at the prospect of a new beginning. Silicon Valley monopolies will be defeated. The people will be triumphant. Thank you all for your support, love, and encouragement. You guys keep me going. I'm only just getting started. God bless you all. Now, that came as a that came as a massive shock to me. Um, but you see this actually happening all over Twitter. Uh, people are losing followers by the thousands, literally by the thousands, um, and that's because we're seeing a massive big tech purge, which is not it's not smart. Um, it's not smart for a lot of reasons, and it's yeah I don't know really. It, it's can we say it's unethical? Probably, but basically a lot of people are being deleted off YouTube. Obviously, Arch has been hacked, but now been deleted and maybe remain deleted. Now, where does this uh, align with me? Like, am I on the chopping block? Because I saw Dave Cullen. Dave Cullen was the one which had me really concerned, like genuinely concerned. Because I was like, I don't think he's actually been that controversial. I don't, I don't see anything controversial in his content. Now, I may not have checked. I didn't check it recently. I haven't been checking it. Uh, since this whole pandemic situation um, I used to watch his Star Trek Picard reviews and I found them hilarious I really liked him um, and I haven't seen him recently maybe he's been very controversial during all the pandemic I don't know but also I don't see anything controversial about questioning things we should always be allowed a, a discourse um, especially when there is no categorical, categorical science and YouTube's own terms currently uh, contradict one another because if your country's uh, policies are counter intuitive to the who's policies then you're literally either or you for or against you you are quite literally breaking youtube's terms which doesn't make any sense um because they say you can't go against your government's policies on the lockdowns or the pandemic should i say and you can't go against the who's that doesn't make any sense we can all agree with that that's absolutely retarded um, so I don't know if he was being ultra-controversial, ultra, ultra controversial, but I really liked his content. I thought he was good. Um, now, this made me really concerned. So I reached out to YouTube today, and obviously people have been reaching out to me, going, hey, really, you need to be careful. People are going to delete you, so on and so forth. Now, I did get a reply from YouTube. Um, it's not massively reassuring at all. Um it's quite vague in their very standard way because that is what they're like. So let me get the actual response up for you. Um, now, I, I quite literally titled the email Purge. <laughs> and I was like, I've heard numerous... My email is quite is short and sweet. I've heard numerous YouTubers are being purged. I'm just wonder, wondering if I'm likely on the chopping block. <laughs> um, and they always deny it. I'm unaware of any purge happening. Please, come on. Uh, though channels which break your our community guidelines can be subject to takedowns. Uh, apparently, I've not been subject to any of these. Um, now, it does say, so as long as you remain in good standing, you'll not be removed for this reason. Now, I was like, that doesn't make any sense to me, but all right. He says, do you have any reason to think you may be in jeopardy? And I said, no. I was like, not really. I was like, but I didn't think David uh, Cullen from Computing Forever would be either. Because I didn't. Uh, so it's a bit of a shock uh, when I see long-standing and good, interesting YouTubers I know being deleted. Um, and they go on, to, again, it's all wishy-washy. I can't speak to other cases, but your channel continues to be in good standing when it comes to community guidelines. To reiterate again, it goes on to talk about... Because I'm demonetized. Like, I just, my videos are demonetized. So it's, it goes on to talk about piss yellow icons. Um, <laughs> are based on eligibility... Uh, not for community guidelines, uh, though they sometimes overlap. Anyway, look, there you go. Um, I am apparently not on the chopping block, but I don't think that that's, 
yeah, I, d I don't think that that's reassurance because I I think there's a lot of people that have you know been purged that potentially shouldn't have been. So whatever. Um, anyway, let me know your thoughts on all this down below. If you're new here, do hit subscribe. Definitely hit subscribe while you can. Make sure you turn the notifications on because then you know that I've not been purged. And follow me on Twitter at Mr. H Reviews. Um, I don't really like Twitter, but you know we should still stay on it a little bit. As long as we can, I guess. Cheers. Take care.